Good morning and welcome back to another vlog. Sorry my hair's a bit bullsacky, I didn't really sort it out before I started filming. But yeah, good morning. I've woken up in London, it's kind of weird because I wasn't expecting it. But look how autumny outside looks from Raven's window. Oh, I love it, it's so cute. Anyway, the plans for today, we're going to two of the museums um, that are uh, local to Aidan's University. So we're going to the Natural History Museum and the Science Museum because we're like geeky and both love like museums. So we're going to go to them. I think we're going out for food both days because we just want to make the most of it and have a good time together. Um, but yeah, I'll take you along with me and see what we get up to in London. I'm so excited though. So basically this glass cabinet is full of triggering items. <laughs> but how triggering is this though? Like if you're actually terrified of some of these things. This Obviously is my hair. Yeah. This is over here. Is it gonna focus on that? Yes it is. Fear of snakes. Fear of the moon? There's one that's fear of the moon. I don't get it. How could you be scared of the moon? Fear of eyes? I don't get it. Like, how could you be scared of eyes? Fear of the colour white? No way are these real. Wait, what? Oh, no, that's not a thing. Fear of Englishness. I actually used to have... Hey, I used to have the dentist one, though. I used to be terrified of the dentist. I'd cry every time. Same. So Aiden and I have come up to the second floor, which is all about like the atmosphere and stuff. We were just on floor one. It was like to do with the human body, and that's like my favourite thing. It's to do with like biology and stuff. Um, yeah, we're now on the atmosphere. Um, they look at me like that. The lighting is so cool in here, like in real life, but it just makes me look really gross on the camera. So I apologise for the lighting. and have just got back from the Science Museum. Uh, we aren't going to go to the other museum today just because it's quite draining after a while, like, walking around the museum because we've been in there for, like, how long did we go in? Like, two hours? We've been in the museum for about three hours, so we've just come back to Aiden's um, room. I never know, like, what to call it, like, accommodation. We're just dropping my stuff off. Aiden just took a few photos of me outside here because it's really cute out there. It's, like, really autumnal. It was cute with my jumper that I was wearing, so... Um, took some photos of my blog and my Instagram and now we're gonna get ready to go to Oxford Street because we're gonna do some shopping, need to do some more Christmas shopping especially for my like friends in Lincoln because I'm always with them and it's really hard to like buy presents when I'm with them so I'm gonna get Hattie and Megan's presents and some more of my family's <laughs> So me and Aiden have just finished in Bella Italia. Our food was so good. I decided to go for a grilled chicken in this time instead of pizza because I always seem to go for pizza. There are so many people around here. Um, but now we're going to carry on shopping on Oxford Street because we didn't really get much shopping done before we ate. So I'm excited to do some more Christmas shopping and all the Christmas lights are up here look so pretty. So we've finally got back to, oh god my vlog's just gone live, so we've just got back from Oxford Street shopping. It's really weird because I didn't buy anything but I did see a few things that I 
am going to get people or like ideas to get some of my family for Christmas which is good because um, I've been struggling for ideas especially with like the males in my family I find boys so hard to buy for um, even more than most people probably would so if you've got any ideas what to get boys apart from aftershave clothes and wine then please let me know um, but we've just got back we bought some nibbles um, we've come back a bit early I think it's about 7 o'clock is it? Let's see what time it is. Oh, it's quarter past seven. Um, we've bought some crisps, magic stars, and I bought a croissant for tomorrow morning for my breakfast. Basically, for my 19th birthday, Aidan bought us a trip to Italy that we're going to be going in March, April time, like in that sort of break at uni. So we're going to plan that tonight and actually book it, hopefully. Um, we're going to be visiting Milan, Florence, and Rome. I'm pretty sure we're going to them three places. If we see anything that we prefer, then we'll probably change it. But we are booking that all tonight, so that's why we came home a little bit earlier, so we could sort it out before we went to bed. Um, and then tomorrow we're going to go, hopefully, to the Natural History Museum, ice skating, and we want to go to the Alchemist for drinks tomorrow, which is so exciting. Um, but yeah, we're just going to do some planning, and then I'll catch up with you later, hopefully, after we've, fingers crossed, booked our trip to Italy. So, Aiden and I have just been chilling for the evening, and we've actually booked our flights and one of our rooms for our Italy trip <laughs> um, but I think I'm going to carry this vlog on to tomorrow because I'm not really sure how much I filmed today because I haven't had time to edit this evening I hope you're enjoying the vlog so far and I will see you when we wake up night good morning so me and Aiden are just on our way to the Natural History Museum we've been out this morning and taken some photos of my vlog because Aiden's my photographer um, and yeah we're going to the Natural History Museum um, hopefully the queue's not as long as yesterday because that was grim but do you reckon it's different because it's Sunday? Don't know. Okay. We're in there for a few hours, but we're gonna go find something hot to eat. It's so Christmassy in the background. <laughs> I love it. Um, but we're gonna to head to Camden Market. We're gonna have a look around there, look at the shops again, and then hopefully go to the Serial Killer Cafe and the Alchemist um, afterwards because they're two places we've been wanting to go for a while. So yeah, that's where we're heading off to now. Serial Killer Cafe, it looks so cool in here. Um, tell me, tell me if the ball's um, And this is our table number. Kind of weird, but um, it's quite cool. Uh, we've just paid two, um, ten pounds for two bowls of cereal, but it's going to be worth it. Hopefully, I decided to get a crunch and crunch and golden grahams with happy hippos and magic stars, and Aiden got apple cinnamon crunch and crunch with a happy hippo as well. Um, we've never been here before. We've always wanted to come, so we're finally here, and I'm very looking forward to my food, even though it's like five pounds for a bowl of cereal. 
this is my cereal. How cute is this? And then it comes with milk, but um, comes with milk, but I fucking hate milk, so so cute. find the alchemist because we're gonna go in there for a few drinks now I actually managed to buy something earlier which is a surprise as soon as I have bought anything at all since we've got here but I'll show you that as soon as we get back to Aiden's apartment what okay look Aiden's accommodation why are you taking a piss that's so rude Alchemist, we head off to Weatherspoons because we were a little bit hungry because we only obviously had cereal for our last meal. Um, so we went to Weatherspoons and got like the three starters for £12, which was so good. We got like chicken goujons and chicken wings, and they were amazing. And then we and then we've literally just come home. So thank you very much for watching this vlog. I think it's gonna be pretty long now because I've obviously used two days of footage, so apologies for that. Thank you very much for sticking around. I really hope you enjoyed this like London vlog rather than my uni vlogs. Let me know. Um, if you did by clicking the thumbs up and commenting down below and let me know anywhere in London that you've been that you absolutely love whether it's just like a shop a restaurant or just like a little cute cafe or something um just let me know subscribe down below if you're new and enjoyed this vlog and I will see you tomorrow I'm going to show you what I got tomorrow just because I only literally got one thing and yeah um I'll see you in tomorrow's vlog bye I'm putting this at the end of the vlog because something hilarious has just happened basically to keep mine and Aiden's drinks we basically bought a like bottle of Fanta the other day um because we were we just fancied like a fizzy drink and Aiden keeps all of his drinks on his balcony he has this like tiny balcony door thing um that only opens slightly and he just puts his drinks down there to like keep them cold um instead of obviously taking them to the fridge like in the kitchen he, it's just easy to keep them cold there which is quite funny anyway um and we'd put it we'd put it out there and we just went to go get some Fanta because he both fancied a cold drink and the Fanta has like slid down and it's like slightly hanging on edge this like little tiny thread here so Aiden's just gone downstairs and I'm gonna try and knock it off with like a coat hanger it's just like a massive mess I don't really know what's going on um but yeah we're gonna we're trying to get this Fanta we really want it <laughs> we don't want the lemonade <laughs> I, I literally don't know what I'm telling you this I just thought it was quite funny how I'm now gonna be like hitting a Fanta bottle with a coat hanger off it literally just sums up um how tragic uni is really.